What is up all of you awesome and amazing people on YouTube? Kuda Malloy here coming at you with another exciting video showing how I make life easier at the campsite. So this is the Eno Underbelly Gear Sling. What this thing is designed to do is it's designed to attach underneath your hammock so that you can put your pack, <laughs> right? And all the crap that you don't want to just leave outside basically. So what I do, this is how I use it, is I usually have an underquilt underneath my hammock, right? This is my big Agnes sleeping bag, war bonnet, hammock, right? You kind of get the idea. I don't want anything else underneath me because if this thing starts sagging, then I'm, my butt's touching the backpack and it's a mess. So what I do is I put the underbelly sling here between the tree and the actual hammock. And you know, this is up for interpretation. Like right now I've got it tied here, but I could have tied it here. I could have tied it here. I could have tied it to this. You get the idea. I could have tied it to here. But the whole point of this is now I've got a work platform, right? I can put my undercoat here and I can open it up and I can take it out without anything touching the ground. Let's say you're in snowy conditions or it's raining and you happen to get, if you saw the previous video, you happen to get your canopy up right or your rain fly or whatever now you're working in the dry areas at least but the ground still might be wet so i don't want my stuff to touch a wet ground so i set up this underbelly gear sling this thing is pretty spacious i mean i've heard stories of like people putting their 40 pound dogs <laughs> in this thing to sleep for the night and the dog feels cozy because it's all wrapped up in like a little blanket you know, that's something you might have to experiment with. But for this purpose of just, you know, I just packed up my under quilts. This is the one tigers, by the way, in case you guys are curious. There are tons, and I mean tons. There you go, one tigers. There are tons of links down below in the description. You might want to check those out. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you like what you're seeing. I'm trying to show people out there that there is rugged, durable gear that's meant for plus size people let's say above average large you get the idea that is available for people to go camping and that's the whole point is to try to get people out there so whatever i can do to make that process easier of camping and backpacking and the like you understand that it just allows more people who might not have otherwise gone camping or backpacking to actually go out there and actually do it so that's really the main goal of these videos so this is just one tool in the toolbox to make it a little bit easier to set up a camp. You know, there, there's no table here, right? I, I just set up my chair. I'm going to do a whole nother review on that. That's the moon lens. Supposedly it holds up to 400 pounds. So far it's holding me up pretty good, but there's no, there's no tables around. So you need a work surface and this is a good place that you can put your stuff airplane to, uh, to basically just have a spot where you could set something up, you could put something in here, you can kind of do whatever. This is a pretty good thick material, like all things considered. It all stuffs back into its own self, like it all stuffs back into this bag. It's got a nice little pull cinch cord thing here with a little thing that cinches down. But it's kind of cool. It folds it folds down into next to nothing. You know, a size is like next to nothing. But for for being able to hang this and have a place to just put stuff in great you know the other cool thing i do is at the end of the night when i'm ready to put my backpack away and i want to stash it and kind of just make sure it's up off the ground no creepy crawlies will hopefully not crawl in there and any extra gear that i didn't use or whatever i'll put it in here i'll keep it in this under sling bag and then the cool thing is is this part just you put like some rocks in here and you just throw it over and now the whole thing is closed and it doesn't allow any openings, right? So this goes underneath, this part comes over, see? And now you've got a little closed container. Looks like you got a, you know, a shark in there, <laughs> some kind of large miscellaneous uh, ocean animal <laughs> or whatever fish that you uh, caught for the night. Hey, maybe you could use it for that too. You're going fishing on a deserted island, <laughs> whatever it takes, right? Put some ice in there. I think it's rated for about 40 pounds. So I would personally, me, I would probably change out these, these uh, cords and all that, but 
you know, you kind of get the idea. You kind of get the idea. So anyways, Eno Underbelly Gear Sling. I'll put a link down there in the description there down below. There's some good opportunities to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button if you like what you're seeing. And I will catch you all on the next... We could probably even sit in this thing if you really want to. That'll be another video. I'll catch you all in the next exciting review.